What's going on everybody? Welcome to the Asian Mai Show. Let me put my neck up so I don't show too much of this neck fat. But overall, um, just like the title says, owning up to your mistakes. So, you know, people ask me about business and business practice and how to be successful. I'm still learning that to this day. But one thing that is for certain is good business practice and just doing the right thing is so important. I, I finished all my jobs yesterday and when I finished all my jobs, I, I found out that there was two items that uh, did not go to the last job. So right in my head, you know, I know that, I you know, at first I blame my guys. I go, oh, my guys, you know, they commingled it. But honestly, the responsibility it's 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 down to me so i have to take full responsibility of this uh although i know that my customer doesn't know that their items are missing yet it doesn't matter doing the right thing is so important i mean i don't care if you believe in karma it, what you believe in but to be successful in business and to be successful in life and just to be an honest person you always just want to do the right thing so I'm headed into the UPS right now. I have a couple boxes right here, a little plastic bin and a little Christmas tree. Uh, it's the principle, you know, they had thousands, hundreds and thousands of items and they might not know that these items are missing, but you know, they paid me great money to move their items. So I just need to do the right thing and uh, ship it back to them. Um, what do you think about that, puppy? Puppy, puppy, what? You think doing the right thing is always good? You tell them, do the right thing. What? What? You want to say hi? Tell them welcome to the Asian My Show. Tell them to subscribe. You are so shameless. You are so. You are trying to advertise me like that. Don't do that, man. Don't tell them to subscribe. What are What are you doing, brother? Sometimes I'm sorry, man. He's my dog. What can I say? Hey. I know I love you too. But all right, time to come into this, not come into this, go into this UPS store and uh, see what the damage is, but it's the right thing to do. All right, I'm going to leave you in the car, but I'm going to leave the engine on. So do not, puppy, I'm talking to you. Do not shift gears. All right, don't do it. All right. That I, I move, the thing that I think that they love isn't the thing they love. It's like... So it's like this is a expensive, you know. These, you know, East Coast they got money, right. but then I, I'm taking care of everything. And I see a little like horse rock rocking chair. I go, ah, yeah, that's yeah, nothing. That's right. But that's the one yeah. that they care about. Okay, both your tracking numbers are on the receipt, and you have a copy of it. No, you're the best. Thank well, you so much. You're very All right. Welcome. I'll take care of the no, I know you will already. I that's that's the thing because I'm from the job. I'm from the West Coast. And we always double and triple checking everybody. But I notice people on the East Coast when they say, "Hey, I got it," I you don't got to go up and say, "Hey, how many Just times like are you gonna you? duct tape it?" I don't want a negative either. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. All right, appreciate you. All right, guys. So I'm leaving the UPS store with a nice lady, and they say people from the East Coast aren't nice. But I'm just joking. But um. Yeah, I feel good. It cost me $89 to get the job done. And of course, that came out of my money, but you know what? Doing the right thing is always the right thing. And and you know what? When people pay for a service, you, you just gotta take care of that service. That's all it is. But I'll talk to you guys later, update you guys. Uh, thank, thank you so much for tuning in as always.